Okay, um, this is just a quick video about uh, water bridges. Um, I have cut a video uh, to show you the exact uh, point of the water bridge and then I uh, I tried to download the video so I could get the audio but it wouldn't let me so I have had to listen to it and basically narrate what they say so this is what they say about an electric water bridge research continues of course even when no immediate benefit is expected at the University of Technology in Gards, Austria Young scientists are seeking to discover why water placed in two glasses and subjected to a high voltage charge will climb the sides of the glasses to meet. It doesn't do it at some random part, but at exactly the spot where the, where the water from the two glasses meet. If we move the glasses away from each other, the water creates a hanging bridge that can be up to two centimeters long. So far, even the world's greatest scientists have been unable to explain the phenomenon. So far, there is not even a theory about the sensational behavior of the water. So there you heard it. Nobody knows. The greatest scientists in the world can't figure this out. Well, it took me about three seconds because I actually worked this out months ago, but this video just popped up and uh, I thought, oh well, I'll just uh, prove another mystery is dead easy to solve with double helix energy. So, as you can see on the screen, there's an exact explanation of what you just saw. I've drawn the configuration of the energy travel going from left to right and from right to left. Then I've done a face view of that water bridge and uh, basically, um, go see the thunderbolts if you don't believe me, but this happens to plasma in space and uh, the electric charges develop a double sheath and keep uh, charges separate and directional flow separate. So what I've got on the screen is exactly what is happening. Double helix flow from left to right, double helix flow from right to left, hundreds of thousands of double sheaths traveling in the opposite direction. Um, if you go see the video, I mean the name, I've left the name on the video so you can go and have a look at it. Um, it also shows it pulsing. This is because alternating current pulses. It goes one way, then it goes the other. It goes one way, then it goes the other. So there you go. It's that easy. So again, um, another mystery solved by double helix energy flow because energy moves, matter cannot move. Matter doesn't move. I don't care what anybody says about potential energy. Nothing moves unless you add energy. They added energy to these two glasses and then the glass water, the water in the glasses swapped sides. One side was green, one side was red or whatever colours they used and the green went to the red side and the red went to the green side without mixing and electrical properties and techniques show that electricity has a double sheath layer. So this water has many sheaths and it is passing backwards and forwards. So it would appear that God has made me the greatest scientist in the world because I have a theory about this and it was easy. See how things are getting so easy. So um, yeah, from X flares to water bridges to atoms to the Mars scar to spiral galaxies, I so far, with the help of God, have explained everything. So thanks very much. My name is Lee and I'm a Christian.